Yo, 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 what's up? Hey guys, it's Melissa. So for this week's video, we are going to talk about a VidCon 2014. I only went for the last two days, so I didn't get to meet everyone that I was hoping to meet, but I met most of the people that I really, really, really wanted to meet, so it was a success. So I just thought that I would talk a little bit about some of the things that happened, and then at the end of this video, I'm gonna have a collage of like everything that I did at VidCon and some Disney, um, because I did go to Disney Day 2 and a couple days after. Um, but yeah, here we go. Okay, so I get off the plane in LA, and I meet one of my really best friends, Hazel, who I have known for a little over a year now. Then we head on down to the convention center and we get there around 11 and we missed a lot of stuff. Registration was empty and we just walked right up, got our passes, and yeah. And Rachel Ballinger walks in and she waves hi to us and I was just like, hi! And it was only us in the room, like me and the people that I was with and Rachel and the people working there and it was like, what? And I'm an idiot and I forgot to ask for a picture, but yeah. We decided to go over by the fountain area and over there we found Miles J and Matthew Lush and Nick Laws, which is what? And we were walking, we were over there and someone brushed up against my like, shoulder. There were like a line of people that yeah. were all over. Yeah, and they were like, excuse me, and I turned and I was like, oh, I'm so sorry. And then I looked and then I was like, wait a minute. It was so oh green. I also found my friend Brittany somewhere during this time. Nash is here. And there was also like a fake coincidence where everyone thought it was Nash. Probably it was Carson. Oh my God. Hi. I'm vlogging. This is Brittany. Well, after we left the Tyler line, my friend Hazel went back to the hotel and met up with our super good friend Eliza. Look who's here. And me. It's Eliza. And, and me's here too. She was actually the one who got me this hat. So I got up and went to the convention center and the line to get in was down the street. There were a couple people in line that I recognized and we got pictures and such. Luckily my friend's mom saved us a spot because she kind of sort of snuck in from the other side. You didn't hear it from me. But we got a pretty good spot and we were in line for Troy Sivan's meetup. By the end of the line, we were going insane because we sat there for 10 hours waiting to meet Troy and we just kept telling the same bad jokes over and over and over again and slowly the people around us started going crazy too. It's been 84 years since I've seen sunlight on a cloudy day. Stay cloudy, JC Caleb. A lot of people are staring at us. <laughs> so I walk up to him and I already embarrass myself with the first thing that I say. I give him a hug and he goes, hi, how are you doing? And I say, I love you. So I mean, that's my current mood. I didn't end up answering how I was. I guess that's just how I was at that moment. That was how I felt. That was how I was doing. How are you doing? I love you. Yeah, same. Okay. <laughs> I emptied out a bottle of ranch and a jar of Nutella and I filled them with tweets from all of their fans saying about like reasons why they love them and so I gave him a little teddy bear and I gave him the Nutella jar and then I also asked him to give the other one to Tyler because I didn't get to meet him and we were just like I, I don't know what where does this go what he was so sweet and it was just amazing and then we took a picture and yeah. Excuse me, you guys can't be right here. So I just met Troy. What the heck? You don't want to be in your vlog. Bye. <laughs> Here's our picture. And then I met up with a couple of my friends, Maddie and Carrie. This is Carrie. Hi. Look, she has a bear that I gave to her. You guys are so celebrities. And then we went back to the hotel and got ready for vid prom. For a couple of smaller YouTubers that I really wanted to meet, like the entire weekend, and I was like, I have to meet them. I will meet them, or else I will regret it. And I ended up finding Hannah Gogan and the Carson Effect in line to get into vid prom, and they were the absolute sweetest people ever and we took pictures and it was really really fun and yeah so then we went back inside and we danced for a little while it was getting kind of late and we were tired and we wanted to go back to the hotel and then it hit me 
This is the last part of VidCon. If I don't meet the people that I want to meet now, I can't meet them. Unless I like find them at Disney Day or whatever, if they are going, I don't know. I, I walked around VidProm for like half an hour looking for Jack Dodds just yelling, Jack! Husband! I ran into my friend Brittany again and she told me that they were in the food court that entire time. And I should have figured but <laughs> if I walk into the food court and I see Ben, Fran, and Jack sitting on the floor and I was just like, be normal, be a person, calm. <laughs> it didn't work out very well. And Jack Dodd stands up and for some reason he makes me really, really nervous. I go, oh yeah, hi, I'm, and I give him my Twitter at. I was expecting him to just be like, oh yeah, cool, whatever, like, yeah. But he asked me, oh yeah, that's a pretty big Twitter account, isn't it? And I literally stood there and stared at his face and didn't answer the question. I realized that he actually asked me something and that I was supposed to answer and I said, okay. Why did I say okay? I don't know. Why do I do anything? Why do I talk to a camera twice a week? Why don't you? Because you're a normal human. Exactly. But I got pictures anyway, so ma I think I'll just rename this video Stupid Things That I Did at VidCon 2014. Okay, this wasn't at VidCon, this was at Disney, but it was another stupid thing that I did. Fran, youtube.com forward slash hello Francis, asked me if I wanted to go ride Splash Mountain with her and hang out with her and her friend and her brother, and I might have fallen off the couch and hit my knee on a table. <clears throat> no, that didn't happen. I would like to say that didn't happen. It happened. I now have a killer bruise on my knee, but it was worth it. Anyway, guys, I guess that's it for this week's video. I probably did a lot more really stupid things, but I can't think of any right now. So that is all, friends. This video, please remember to like it and give it a big thumbs up. It felt weird saying like it. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Comment down below if you went to VidCon or if you're planning to go to VidCon. Remember to subscribe to this channel. I make videos every Wednesday and every Friday with Grant, so subscribe for more to come. Bye, guys! Now for the collage thingy. Even wearing my hater shoes. Okay, talk to you guys later.
He's a disco in a jerk off and crazy. <laughs>